Hi, Mary. Uh, thank you for being with us today. Could you uh, maybe introduce yourself and introduce what is FEI? Well, thank you, Armand, and it's great to be here. Thank you for having me. Uh, my name is Marie Holwein. I'm president and CEO of Financial Executives International, and Financial Executives International has been in existence now for 80 years, and we are an organization of senior-level financial executives, mainly CFOs. We are very honored to have you with us. Uh, maybe you can explain why you think it, for you it was important to attend Financium. Why it's important for me to be here is that we recognize uh, from the U.S. the thought leadership of the CFOs and uh, the senior level financial executives, um, both domestically and internationally. And being uh, present here at the Financium um, allows us to share some of our uh, recent surveys that we've done and our thought leadership, especially our most recent uh, CFO Outlook survey. We also are interested in seeing what are on top of the minds of the CFOs um, and understanding what the trends are. And in addition, my presence here um, affords me the opportunity to be able to work with you and uh, in our organizations and discuss where there are opportunities to work together. So in the U.S., we, you had the same crisis we had, and also you had a few weeks ago some elections. So what do you think are going to be the, uh, the impacts of these elections? We have had quite a, a bit of an of excitement, if you will. Um, the impact, first of all, of the crisis, just assuming, you know, we're talking about the U.S. here. And one of the most important impacts have been some of the legislative changes and rules and regulations, such as the Frank Dodd Act, which um, is quite interesting. There's like 500 new rules as a result of it. So it will take a, a while to implement, although the SEC anticipates that it'll be done over the next 18 months so they'll be creating jobs there um, the other thing as far as the elections um, it was it was quite interesting um, I expect to see some things like the Bush tax cuts be extended uh, so there's been quite a bit of change in Washington so now let's talk about our CFOs which are our members uh, so which major changes do you see for the CFO as an individual and maybe also for the CFO organization? Major change I see for the CFOs are their roles have been expanded somewhat. They're not just the CFO, but they also are the, oftentimes a chief accounting officer, liquidity manager, treasury manager. And depending on the size of the company, certainly, they wear multiple hats. Uh, in addition, one of the major changes I've seen with the CFOs in the past few years is that their tenor that used to be much longer is now only from 18 months to two years. So that's a significant change. You have a quarterly survey. Uh, can you give us the main results of your last survey? It was quite interesting. Uh, our last survey actually showed uh, about a two-point increase in the optimism from our CFOs, uh, where we're seeing that CFOs are starting to hire again, our new employees, but more importantly, that they're really focused on retaining the good talent. Uh, that's, um, it, we actually, with the increase in the optimism, we saw a dip in the last quarter, um, but we still see that companies and CFOs are proceeding with caution. Thank you very much, and thank you again for being with us. Thank you. Thank you.